Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 9 e-commerce tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about how to edit the product category. So let's see how can we edit the product category. So first of all, uh, let's create a new liveware component for edit the product category. So switch to the command prompt and uh, run the command php artisan make colon liveware a space component name uh, first add here the directory name which is admin slash component name admin edit category component okay now hit enter component created now run the application all right now switch to the project And let's create the route for this component. So just go inside the routes directory and then open web.php file. And inside the admin middleware group, uh, inside this group, uh, let's create here a new route. So right here, route get URI admin category edit and pass here one parameter category underscore id okay and then add here the class name component class name admin edit category component colon colon class and set the route name name admin dot category dot edit Okay, now save this file. Now go to the resources directory, then views, liveware, admin, and from here let's open this one admin edit category component dot led dot php file. Okay, and inside this file just remove the stem, and now let's copy uh, the all the content from this view. Okay, admin add category. From this view. so just select all the text copy and paste here okay and uh, here let's change the title heading edit category also change here okay now go to the admin uh, edit category component class file so inside the app directory http liveware admin and from here let's open this one and inside this class let's create a property so right here public uh, first property which is the category id okay uh, this one so here just write category id dollar category id and then public dollar name public dollar slug all right now let's add here the lifecycle hook method mount method so right here public function mount and then pass here the uh, parameter category id okay then dollar category is equal to model name category column column find uh, find the category according to this category id okay so right here dollar category id all right now dollar this arrow category id is equal to dollar category arrow id and now just copy this paste two time change here the property name name and also change here name slug 
and here slug. All right. After this, uh, let's create a function here for generating the slug. So right here function public function and the function name generate slug okay i'm just going to copy from here generate slug this one and paste here okay also import this str so let's copy this one and paste here All right and uh, now for adding the validation let's copy this one and paste here okay now let's create a function for updating the category so right here public function and function name update category Okay, and inside this function, just write dollar category is equal to category find dollar this arrow category ID. Now, dollar category arrow uh, set the name so name is equal to dollar this arrow name and then category arrow slug is equal to dollar this arrow slug and then call the save method so right here category save and after this just uh, put a message inside the session plus message okay so right here session arrow plus and set the key message and uh, add here the message category category has been updated successfully Alright, and uh, before this updating, uh, just before this line, uh, let's add here. First of all, validate the value. So, right here, dollar this arrow validate. Okay, and uh, inside this, just copy and paste here. All right, now let's copy this update category method and uh, go to the view file and here inside this form just remove this method and paste here okay update category all right now save this file Now go to the admin categories component view file. Uh, let's open this one. And here inside this table, let's add here the edit link. So inside this KD, let's add here. Anchor tag href. Okay, then add the class text info and add in the text edit and inside this this href just pass here the double curly bracket route and route name. Uh, let's copy this route name 
so again paste here and now just pass here the category id so inside the big packet category underscore id arrow dollar category arrow id okay now save this file now everything is done so let's check so switch to the browser and refresh the page and you can see here the edit link okay now let's edit the category so let's edit this one so click here and you can see here the category name and their slug okay now let's change the category name so i'm just going to write here updated okay now just click on submit and you can see here category has been updated successfully click on all categories and you can see here category updated so in this way you can update the product category so that's all about edit product category so thanks for watching this video and if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching.